very good evening to you i hope you are well how are you doing today welcome to your weekly tea right here on y254 tv we call it chit chat my name is philin jean and of course if you see me here on a sunday it's all about gossip and trending topics right here in kenya and globally as well stories that have been making headlines right now to help me break these stories down are the gang gang my co-hosts and of course, they're not new to the show. Let's meet them, starting with our very own Bantu. What's up? Hello. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Honest Bantu is my name. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. We are no. the close end. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, my name is Ernest Bantu. Koale wa nijui, koale wa nijua, santeni, ni wakati wakachai. Just chill out, manze. Yeah, that's what's up. Yeah. And we have our very own rapper and tech head representing for Chicha today. What's up? What's up? What's up? What did do? What's it? What did do? What did do? What did do, Ronald? What did do? What did does? Royce <laughs> in the building. <laughs> uh, what's up? What's up, my people? Kama kawaida mna jua mvuele anza kunyesha kuna baridi. But now kutoa yo baridi, we are here to serve you the hottest in town. That's what's up. And Filin is going to give you the menu. Mm -hmm. yep. Now the hashtag is Chicha. We are on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter as Y254 channel let us know where you're tuned in from and we'll be sending some love your way at the end of the show and of course that is if you want to be part of the show you can also send in your contributions we'll sample those comments when we are done and of course i also i also what did i also want to do <laughs> i had that on top of my head and just like that is zone. But zone. welcome 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 to the show we're gonna have a fun one today of course come on, uh, on social media at feeling jean at anis bantu and at ronald royce that is where you find us right yeah. now let's get started right here with our first story and timothy a mechanic from lagos nigeria was surprised when he found 10 million nigerian naira in his bank account now despite the temptation timothy immediately contacted the owner and returned the money. The grateful businessman gave him a mere 50,000 naira, which is equivalent to 14,000 Kenya shillings. And though disappointed, Timothy felt proud of his honesty and integrity. News of his good deeds spread quickly, earning him the respect and admiration from his community and inspiring others to follow his example. Although some people on social media felt as though the token of appreciation was too little. We have a video. Let's have a look. This opportunity to introduce this Mr. Timothy to everybody who shows concern. Yesterday around 4 p.m., I mistakenly transferred 10.8 million into his account. And he came on his own to come and return the money back to me. Jesus! This is my mechanic. If you have a car... For those who didn't get it, so basically what's happening, uh, the boss, the guy who's speaking, is a contractor, right? So this guy is his mechanic. So I got to my 10 million, which is like 3 million Kenyan shillings, into his mechanic's account. So the mechanic did the right thing. He's like, Ew. I think you sent me this money by mistake. So this guy, like where this, the mechanic works, and he called a lot of people to come and witness. This is a man of integrity. Umsiya merudisha 10 million. Imagine, you guys need to be like him, this and that. Naoto na muliza, nambonu mpeiki tu. So basically, out of 3 million, akapea mechanic 14 guy. But the point is, alimpea kitu. What are we thinking? Feeling what you're looking Before even we talk about that, let me start with Anes. Anes, new to me, Vilina Kuanga. Let me ask you, where you can find out to say three million? Kwa kamtiako. 
Na umu nina metuma ni kama hata juju hata za kupigia simu kukwambia like ati oh nilituma 3 million so what are you doing with the money? Like right now tuseme tu kwa, kwa situation yenye you know yenye wa a lot of people are in right now. So wendo kusema sema kwa situation niku. Tuko. Sema kwa situation niku. Wepana ni 3 million zimetulia tu. Uh. I would have to meet her 500k before, by the way, he does the angle. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. But in this story, where is your job? Una jua Nigeria ni nchi ya madumba, nchi nyingine mbaya sana. Mtu anaweza kwa kutumia hizo dog mbaya anakutest. Mm -hmm. So sometimes pia ni poa kukuwa tu honest rudishie mtu pesa yake. Sasa unaweza kataa hiyo pesa ikuongeleshe. Ianze mm -hmm. kukuambia nirudishe kwetu. Sijui nini nini. <laughs> Tena unasema sasa ni nini nilifanya. As in sometimes kuanga tu honest ni kopoa. So lazima upray watu wanaombanga inafa uombe kwanza. God anaweza kushow direction. Right. Yeah. I I I'm so, I'm just like surprised Ronald. I can't speak for you. But are you returning the money or are you keeping the money? I don't know. 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 I don't know that you've used, eh? mm. I think it was the end of um, the, uh, when you're reading, yeah. that you are supposed to be like who? Mwenye alituma pesa ama mwenye alirudisha pesa? I think you should be like the one who returned, returned the money. Right? <laughs> He's a man of integrity. Ah, but seriously. Right now with the current economy, with the maandamano, someone can be able to afford kurudisha um, 3 million Kenya shillings if you convert, that is right? <laughs> Mimi <laughs> siwezi. Because I'm looking at where I am right now. Mm -hmm. Now, first of all, this guy is a mechanic. Yeah. And you know mechanics, mo most of the time, they will always depend on uh, daily cash. They don't have like a monthly thing. In a kwa when you garage and then you get whatever you're getting, then you go home. Yeah. So, um, say, I'm a part of 14K. I know he de never had the 14K, but sometimes also God gives you that direction. There is always some calls that come from nowhere. Now, this is what we call the miracles. What uh, we can always translate? By the way, do you know I've literally heard of Christ's preach and they speak <laughs> of miracle money? Like, when you talk account balance, you find money. Like, why are you tracing the owner? I'm kidding. Please don't, like... Yeah, I know. Why are you tracing the owner? We don't have to trace. <laughs> no, the right thing to do is to trace the owner, by the way. Yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> Feeling is in the stories as a miracle money all the time. They're like, you uh, some accounts, you would end up account, you would have a pesa, and you would have a new kazi. So, me, if I found it, I'll be like, my pastor said it. No, my oh, pastor said it. I'm feeling and I would have done it. Zilla stories as a CRE. The Kitambo and Wana Samati. As a Christian. As a Christian, woman to me. What will you do? <laughs> At you, 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 what will you do with the money? Return mm -hmm. to the owner, choice A. Well, choice hey. B, use it. Ujuni C, leave it. Ujuni kwanini walikuwa na eka nini? Motipo choices hapo. Sao walikuwa na juu kijiandikia. Ujuniika vituko ilavili tuwa kuandikia. Ujuniika, inge kwa high school. You know high school, they don't ask such questions. But inge kwa high school. High school, wezi uliza. Upeane your own explanation. Nasema, bro, kwanza, we. Unajua sijalipa school fees ya this month. Ya this month. Sina pocket money. Sina pocket money. Pocket money, right? Hata we mwenye unamak jiulize kwanza kwa mwenye unamak. Eh, utafanya. Ingerudisha. Right. But it's so crazy though. Like, but mechanics also, like, mwenye skero na kisimati, oh, they just go to work and they have, um, you know, like the daily bread. I don't think that's true at all. Like, Mr. Jew, I do mechanics were going because <laughs> the mechanics were going to do. I don't know when you're going to do it. They fall. I don't know when Most times, like, uh, uh, not everyone, but some of them, they get involved with different ladies. So, and I don't know when you're going to do it. See, okay, but point is, he has many cars. Lena could have a range, Kesana could have a mark, Kesana could have, you know. So, my ball. So, eh. <laughs> always boiling with different cars and different yeah like um sorry to say this but there's a um just recently there's a mechanic who crashed or uh, in pangani right mm -hmm. mm. and unfortunately he lost his life but i'm just saying like they do that they ball and they're always like rolling in different cars 
Mhm. Madam akiwa naye anasema my man has cars, cars mm. for days. Ukimzele gari ya jana iko wapi? Anasema babe sasa si ile ya jana ni nini compared to this one? Have you seen the yeah. Mm. So I'm just saying. <laughs> but feeling, no? It, it maybe it just in a di- it's a it, it it happened in a different country because me and so if it happened here where Ah yeah 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 my friend wacha ni kwambia Bowling na hizo magari vibaya. Mimi mali mimi upeleka gari yangu I want to mention where hapo hivi unapeleka gari kama ni full tank. Sasa zile utaendea jioni. Ndio ujue ndio ujue. You drive you drive back to the to, to the field. You like when we we'll extract mafuta like na mimi jambo mali napeleka gari yangu. Unaona niulize mali na Futsubishi inapeleka wapi? Volkswagen, Volkswagen inapelekwa car wash. Ama Subaru. That's why yeah. being a lawyer is a software. You know, it's easy to to nambiwa ngat is it to you will go to and get them in heaven. Heaven uta endesha range it off. See when endesha to up. We never know. Oh, ngoja 5 years. years. But we living in hope. <laughs> But let me tell you something. Shout out to Timothy. It is good to be a man of integrity. Me, according to me, he did the right thing. Like you, you did the right thing, returning mm. the money. And uh, shout out to you, Mimi Shida. The, the the main problem I have is the person who had the money. When you pay sir, you can't just take three million and give someone fifty, like fourteen k. I can give better fifty k, right? But you know, no, nani mjinga apa, nani mjinga. Katia the two of them. But you never know. Maybe you don't account. Ama ni kazi. Eh ni kazi ama ni kazi. No, you let... never know. So Kenya amepewa tu accept. Ajui hiyo ndio ingine. No, Anes, let us not speculate. Nani mjinga hapa? The guy is who was not supposed to take back. Atu jinga, kuna mjinga, kuna mjinga kwa. Kuna mjinga. Ah, Feeling, feeling. Mtu anaishi. Okay, let, I'm I'm sorry to say but pengine this guy lives in a in a place that is very deplorable and mm-hmm. then being that good guy ameamuaje acha nirudishe 3. 3 million upate 14k. Ronald Royce alikuwa anajua anakuwa 14k. Ah alijua anakuwa 1 million. Hiyo ndio shida. Alijua labda ka 200k mahali 300 million. 14k. That is not even 0.0001. Kwa hiyo 14k mjaeka kwa pesa. But anyway, but anyway, you know what we move regardless of that we move. Talk to us. Wewe ungefanya aje. If it were you, would you return the money or not? I would love to hear from you. That is on YT54 channel. Talk to us. The hashtag is a chit chat. And now we move on to another story right here. And students at Chesamis Boys High School in Bungoma County, Kenya, returned stolen items after their deputy principal's emotional plea through prayer, right? Now the school had experienced a string of thefts, now leaving students and staff frustrated. However, when the deputy principal began praying and crying, the students were moved and realized the impact their actions had on the school community. Now they started returning stolen items where the deputy principal was praying from one by one. The incident served as a powerful reminder of the importance of empathy and understanding in creating a positive school environment. You cannot make these stories up. We have the video. Let's have a look.
right? Like, I don't know. Like, um, this just reminded me. Have you ever seen an, uh, like, when growing up, when you were have you ever seen an adult cry because of something you did? Ile guilt in a cool, I was just like, oh my God, what did I do? So the students were like, I work on a lana. They were like, in lana, lana. They were like, you know what? I tend to dish, I mean, liba tiny, liba sweater. Have you ever done something like that? Which how I feel guilty for something you did and you had to make it right? Ni kwanza kwanza mbonea western je hapa western western kuna kuna na mambo mingi sana lakini anyway ni sawa tu okay hii ni hii story iko hivi au unajua ni kama mzazi zingine wazazi hutuzia uoga una kitambo sikuna idea hata mzazi kwa hao mzazi anamwambia rudisha rudisha mwenye arudishi ile kitu ndamfanyia na obvious hakuna kitu atafanya but ile kitu ndamfanyia mpaka unaona unajisema ni nini no, no. I'm not so many prayer, the power of prayer. Jup sasa kina niomba yeah. kaomba. Kuna the power of prayer pia. Jua yeah, nasema ali, aliomba akilia, si ndio? Mm-hmm. Kuna the power of prayer. Prayer zilifanya students wakaongeleshwa na Mungu wakasema kumsheni mm. na wakarudisha. The Holy Spirit came down. Yeah. Yeah, so, okay. mm-hmm. so you never know what happened but mm. according to me no, no, <laughs> I dispute. <laughs> <laughs> this thing was stage managed. Ah, yeah. <laughs> 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 We have to go. We are going viral. Like, come on, come let on. Let me tell you. Let me tell you something, Philip. Mm-hmm. Do you know? Um, sometimes, mambo ya God inakwanga very, very important, and people should not play with mambo ya God, because if at all it was a miracle that I was a water, when little copper red wing, they were attached. They were attached. They were kujia paka na besheni. Wale kujia paka na zile vitu waliiba. Wale kujia na everything. You sweaters to and then number 2 mm. ukiangalia vizuri the setup uyo, okay huyo deputy aliamua tu sasa aende apige tu magoti aanze kulia ndio watu warudishe vitu let me no, I you. think you were just like praying. You know, know like how sometimes you have a function and a teacher or a student, anyone decides to pray. Sahani. So probably he did, he started praying mm. and uh, maybe he was just in the spirit, praying in the spirit and he it, he got carried away and just continued Why praying. didn't he have to pray for people to pass exams? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> they don't perform well. Yeah. And plus, <laughs> I don't think like he was mentioning like let's say kama kuna kitu uliba, like kama hauta I don't think he was threatening them. I just mm. think it's out of their own like Leo ni Sunday acha ni ubirie Ron kidogo. Mimi ni kama chacha huko. Okay. Acha ni kuubirie. Na kikupata binguni mimi narudi wewe. Hautarudi Jumaombi itakugeuza. Let me tell you something. Unaona kama wewe ungekuwa zile enzi za Zakayo. Unajua Bible kuna msaidi kwa Zakayo. Zakali aliongeleshwa na Yesu na akarudisha ushuru. Zile ushuru alikuwa na So unaona uwezi sema ati Zakayo ilikuwa staged. Mhm. Naona ati Jumbo na alirudisha na kurudisha za siku nyingine unaona so yeah. as in isn't it to uh, god and work through different ways honest umai no. umai ba shule shule mm. eh. sisi I, i won't mention the school but the school i was uliko na nikashati unashikilia mpaka kauke hata ukiitwa tu ronald uangalie hivi nyuma mm. ukiangalia hivi imeenda so in school this is where these things happen right <laughs> but why do people do that <laughs> i have a friend a friend of mine was telling me alikuwa anaishi kwa hii neighborhood yenye like unajua yeye alikuwa anapiga ngal luku so ako na viatu ako na jeans nini so amenda akaosha akaanika hapo kwa kamba akakaa hapo kwa na istola it's too much the, the sun is too much mm-hmm. so he's like at jua kwa window iko tu hapo kwa kwake so he's like tena ndio kwa nyumba niangalilie kwa window Bila tu alteremka ama sione hivi zipi kwa wind ama hii kama imehama You go back quickly outside unapata hujapatana na mtu kwa stairs na hujapata nguo zako like funny Nikaiona yama Anyway hapo niambia ni wapi alikuwa anaishi But I'm so funny so I, I can relate to kisema hiyo Yeah way. back in school unajua sasa umeanika longi vizuri the next day unaenda na boxer parade But shule <laughs> shule tumeiba shule nani hajaiba shule Na ukurudisha sasa yeah. that's where the problem is But mtu akuomba 
Hakuna mtu aliyeomba. Hii kitu ninakuambia ni maombi ilifanya wakarudisha. Hawakurudisha juu ya kitu kingine. So is the power of prayers. Yeah, hiyo you know, nimesema ni power. Like, plus it, it was more like the right of passage. Kama haujaibiwa shule it's weird. Like na kama hujaibiana shule pia it's weird. Mimi naweza kumbuka the first. Mimi niliiba. But I don't liba feeling. No, I don't think I used to. Ah, no feeling wewe uliiba. Feeling ana kingine. Unajua unakanga tu innocent. Unakanga tu innocent like. Unachukua unarudisha. Labda uchukue alafu mwenyewe. Hiyo ndio wizi. Kuiba ni kuchukua. Unachukua unarudisha. Eh, hiyo ni wizi. It's borrowing. It's not stealing. Ah, unachukua kama mwenyewe. Na banyu unakanga mu innocent. I don't think I did. I don't know. Did I? I don't think so. I remember when I was in form 4. So zile mastude wanaletwa the form 1s are being admitted. So unajua uko na sanduku, uko na beshe ni uko na mattress. Mm. So ilikuwa inafika mahali we are three form 3s and uh, one form 4. So form 4 anaenda na sanduku hivi. <laughs> form 3 anaenda na mattress hivi, alafu mwingine anaenda na beshen hivi. So unaja form 1 amesimama na changa atafuata gani? Cuz hii inaenda huku ingine inaenda huku inaenda huku. But that is so unfortunate. <laughs> People like that, but they don't learn kama hizo they just follow you. You're just in life wondering like nilifanyanga nini? Ni mtu. <laughs> God, what happened to me? Come and why only this line? Don't do that. Cuz manga he was young and stupid. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, speaking of from once, let's talk about another story that is actually really super shocking. Now, in a shocking incident, a from one student was caught by teachers with rolls of bang sewed to his body. Now the incident which was caught on video and has since gone viral shows the teachers cutting the students shots to recover the rolls of bang now the teachers reportedly threatened to call the police as the incident has sparked an outrage among parents and the public who are calling for stricter measures to be taken against drug abuse in schools we have a video <laughs> Kwa <laughs> tu. <laughs> <laughs> ni mwingine ako nayo eh yule ni pewa na nani yule 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 tunapaswa nipigie tunakapigia hakuna kukaa na yeye ati unakaa na yeye sana right so I don't know. I mean when I was in school in form 1 like bro, kuna vitu zingine you never had to worry about. How do you even worry about drugs and you're in form 1? Mm -hmm. You're literally probably 13 years. So, when I'm told so 13 year old and I'm in a bangi like I'm just I don't know. But honest, do you think it's the hard I'm at the tough economic times so What do you mean? Hmm. What do you mean? Mapo mwana wanachoma tu, ma class 8 wanachoma. <laughs> class 4. <laughs> class 4 wanachoma. Wani for mwana na zimuna stuka nini? Mimi ni mimi stuka. I'm like what kwani tunaishi wapi? Na kwanza the guts of actually bringing it to school. That's something else. Si ni kutafuta si ni pedi. Hapo hmm. na kutapa baba ni pedi. Na ni kutafuta soko kupanua bizi kwa bidi. Wewe si jua manje. El Chapo. Eh, <laughs> in the making in the making eh ama unaweza kutakuna beshte yake ni pedi mm -hmm. na huyu jamaa ananga do hiyo ni one way of course as in before I judge mambo ya drug ni lazima ufuatilie story kila kitu na kuangana a story mm -hmm. behind it wewe oh, wewe mtu yeye ajamka tu leo na akaamua nitauza mashashi kwa shule una yeah. lazima lazima kuna kitu ime happen but siku hizi ana watu hiyo from one ndo wanatupiga ngeta But Ron, seriously, do you think his future is ruined? Because um, in the video, you literally hear uh, the teachers saying like, ah, 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 ini mingi ilazima tuite polisi. This is a police case. So what do you think happens to him? Because I'm just like, uh, we, I'm, I'm curious. 
Feeling. When then you at a pele kwa juvi, I'm like, uh, of course he's going to be suspe suspended. That's mm -hmm. one thing. But I'm just like, so do you think the police are going to act on you? Is he going to, to like uh, juvi? First things first. Mm -hmm. Hard economic times calls for hard things like hard drugs. <laughs> number, <laughs> number two, he was caught pants down, mm -hmm. but I think he was caught he was caught pants high. Number three, the what? future is very high. The future of that guy is very high. Who said I'm going to say that? Is it my house and is it Let me tell you, there's this notion uh, back in school that these mm. vitu kivuta sa zingine ndi uneza una grasp. Oh, by the way, that is the notion. Right? That's the tradition. That's actually true. Yeah. People used to believe, um, like, if you smoke bang, then it makes you smarter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Was it true though? Yeah, was it, it was. See, see, was, it, was, see, was it true? It is, is it? true. Is it true? Mimi I like the jaribu, so I can't <laughs> actually tell you. Like, on a job biologically, the mm -hmm. medulla oblongata, okay? There are cells in the medulla oblongata that open, op opens up to certain modules of the smoke. Oh, okay. nadanganya, bro. Like, there's no... I, I don't <laughs> think I... Hakuna kiti smoke kita kisa ikana. Oh, nadanganya. Like, there's nothing. Hii kitu ulikuwa na vuto na kwa mwerevu. Ay, wakuna. The thing is... Hakuna kwa ya vile na degree ngati. Eh, sita. Hakuna ule mzalizi mama prezo wa naizambia wa jakoya. Bob Marley. Hakuna wana unge mama education wa kivya kwa jakoya. And he's a lawyer. A lawyer and a good one at that. Yes. By the way, Rona got to serve. Ah, I see. You know, like, we're not trying to encourage anyone. Come on, like, ushika nishi, shule, atuende, like, you smoke bang. Like, I think it just makes you think. But enough for you to have career, Sana. No, no. The thing is, uh, mm -hmm. I rem I, uh, okay. Drug. It depends on how um, it will adapt with the, the situation in your life. For instance, to look on a jamaflan, look on a vutanga shule. I won't mention again the school. Yeah, look on a vuta. I look on a vuta. Then I show. I love to talk in je. I na chungule kama. I na one. I kunamu to na kuja. So zi kamshika. So I look on a talk in je. I na vuti in je. I na inge kwa chwa na ngale. I kunamu to na kuja. So it normally like uh, it, it it will adapt to the kind of thinking you have. But that's weird because. Mr. Bangi, it's one thing, like literally, if someone passed here, you'll be like, You're in the Bangi. <laughs> right? You just know. So, how do you hide that? What we can be at you, I'll put you on a pita, and like, you know, like, I'm not talking to you, you could just say, man. When I just start, you're like, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Let me tell you something. You know, on a story of Bangi, what's your name? That's about number one. Number one, you call him. You like to to me, I'll jim on your anatomy. Feeling ya jini kwa utusi msewa mgoka juu utumiangi mgoka msewa mgoka na shindo unasema ni kama utusi msewa fegi na uvutangi fegi sawa sawa bangi wakodu sawa juu wanajua kenye akuna mtu na vuta bangi kujibamba kila mtu akona reason na vutanga akuna mtu na vuta bangi kujibamba la but fegi wana vuta kujibamba lakini bangi bangi akuna mtu na vuta kujibamba walai people do it just for fun honest with you serious filin na juu at times bangi wanga na kipati ya what you call confidence um, as, as an artist, I've uh, met several but artists. But you're not cheesy, so please. Uh, uh, yeah. Feeling I mean, that, honest, you know I'm speaking with you. No. Bangi no. and cheesy. <laughs> then like, Jamaica, like, then like, Jamaica say what kill him to get him to him. Jamaica wana choma. Yeah, no. Ah, uh, uh, but it's, it, it's, uh, it's limited. See, it's limited. It's limited. It's limited. Problem me. Like, nikama, it's regulated. Problem me. It's legalized, but it's very regulated. It's not like that you can just smoke uh, however. So, when the wazimu no wanyo wanayitumi excessively? Na nani mo nyatumi, ajapimi wana vutanga mingi. Yami cheese. With Khalifa, with Khalifa na Snoop. Yeah. Oh, I have to go to the limit. But when I put them in the camera, you think like that's how they live their life normally? Maybe they just do that for the cameras to just show like we are cool and we do that. Khalifa. Okay, so Feline, what you mean is the people who smoke bang. And I'm sure it's not like they spend the whole day doing it. When they say kuna watu now, once they start like they can't eat without it, they can't. But then you appetizer. And uh, they can't eat without it. They can't sleep without it. When they wake up in the morning, they have to, like, you know. And then it becomes like too much. I and wish it, to zero. It zero and get one watch you show. I and I control <laughs> like Piaco. <laughs> I wish to zero and get one. But then, but then, seriously, it's, it, it, it's, 
illegal so kipatikane nayo you on your own mtu siku chote oh ni cool just do it but ukipatikana lakini kwa lakini unajua tuambie tuambiane ukweli on live tv tuambie do you think are you a stoner do you do you think you ni illegal moja ni malize story kwanza do you mean that sana tuambie i used to be ah i used to be I used to be why lie? Hakuna mtu wa ghetto mwenyewe atakwambia sijawahi. Unajua nakuona ngo na kuanga chizi chizi kumbe ni kweli. Ah, maliza 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 question. Maliza maliza point. Mbona mbona mko hivyo? Acha nikwambie. We have to take a break. Finish finish your point. Let's take a break. Ni wame bagi ni fire. Je, sorry. Je, sorry. Je, sorry. Je, sorry. Je, sorry. Je, sorry. Well, thank you so much for staying with us. If you're just joining us right now, this is Chit Chat right here on GY254, your favorite youth channel. I go by Feline Jin. This right here is Alice Bantu. And we have Ronald Royce as well. We're all about gossip and trending topics, right? Now, let's move on to another story right here that has caught our attention. And uh, in Thailand, there's a viral video that is uh, actually uh, circulating on social media showing a group of, uh, actually not a group, just an elephant stopping sugarcane tracks on their way to factories. The elephant uh, then proceeds to steal a few cans before uh, letting the drivers continue on their way. The footage has brought amusement and awe to viewers, showcasing the intelligent and resourcefulness of the magnificent creatures. Now, while the drivers may be inconvenienced in one way or another, it's hard not to be impressed by the elephant's ingen uh, ingenuity and determination to satisfy their sweet tooth. We have a video. I'm just thinking, I think this elephant um, it, it's a sugar cane probably by mistake one time and then it was like bro, mimi ndo nakulanga nyasi nakuna what? nakuna nyasi tamu nakuna nyasi ni tamu I've quit, I've quit no no no, it comes to the, to, to the road and it's like bro, smama smama, and then you have to stand in a chikuwa zake, nina kwachia njia it's just like okay fine, I don't need a lot I just need like five you know, do you think we have elef like elephants? Like, can you share your ones? Make them. Hey, my friend. Kanza, elephants zina kuangani omnivorous. Ah. Amani carnivorous. Amani, amani herbivorous. They, they, they only eat grass. What is that called? Carnivorous. Habi uh, uh, grass. Not carni. 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 Herbs. 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 Carni. Should be herbs. Shrubs. Na omnivorous ni sisi. Yeah. Atu bagui. Like no kula nyasi, no kula nyama, anything. Sasa elephant ni ni habs ndio mm -hmm. sasa iko sawa lakini hiki kitu mimi naona ni imetumiwa na mtu <laughs> no, na mtu ameyeka madumba endanga pale usimame mbona inajua gari ndogo sikudai ndio mbona wanyama wana akili lakini hiko na akili sasa so, ukiona mnyama ana akili hiyo inatumiwa na mtu but they said elephants are very intelligent, intelligent yes way. i heard like even when one of them pass they go, they, ca they they gather around the carcass and they literally mourn. Mm -hmm. And probably, I don't know if it's true, but I have like true. even after like a year, they visit the place just to huh? pay homage. <laughs> I don't know if it's true, Amani Kelele, but no, I know they literally pay homage to their own. Like they mourn, when, when, when you are like they feel really bad about it. 
No, okay, Feline, mm. you're very right. Because elephants, especially the African elephants, mm. they're very intelligent in nature. And the, they are, the IQ is always, always compared to the IQ of a human being. Mm. Because um, the way they think, the way they do their things, just the same way as humans do. Lakini kuna zetu wapa. Unaona kama hizi zineza simamisha zinamisha eh, track. Kazi zinaenda kazi na kula maidi ya mtu yote. <laughs> Alafu na hii economy. <laughs> Elephant ni yone. Nyama. Uh, one thing I like about this one. Mm. This one it, like it's like there are like probably a hundred trucks in a day. So ni kishikwa tu turn off from every truck. I'm good. Like is a Kenya zitakuja ziangusha hiyo gari. Za Kenya kwanza. Kwa hivyo mnajaribu kusema elephant za Kenya zina brain. Ah, <laughs> greedy <laughs> <laughs> just like us you know us people we, like we the environment. Mtu mtu atikwangi kidogo. Like ukipata place ya kula mtu anachukua. Kenya za greedy. So tumefunza pia wanyama. I'm just Kwa wanyama wetu ni. I'm serious. Zinaenda kwa plantation. You've not had these cases where like elephants and humans they are, they are not coexisting vizuri. Eh, Because elephants zinaenda zinakula ndizi, zinaenda zinakula maindi yote. Hizi sema acha ni kule kidogo kesho tutarudi. Like the the whole point ni kuharibu like acha tumpe asara, you know. But these ones they are like literally so smart. It's like, you know what? But I know any hustle we all need each other. Then you need track kesho. Think think of it from this uh, perspective. The way life is hard right now. Mhm. Mimi niko na truck. Ki elephant ndo wiki. Watoto wako home nja. Na hii ni nyama. Nita stop. Utashikwa. Nitashikwa kwa nini? That is a, a, a human know animal conflict. How long you're going to jail for, you know? It's killing. trespassing. It is not trespassing. It's on my They'll way. They literally put you didn't see the post elephants crossing right no. there. So you miss mama too. Where we change route basi. Ni pitie kwa bush. Apo kwa miu. So Philin Philin ka mini lawyer. Apo pia anaweza anaweza kushinda kesi. Apo apo ni elephants passing not elephants standing. Yes. Hii ni kwa ina stealing. The point is the point is probably um like maybe this side is forestry and the other side is also foresty in a way so mnapata barabara imepita katikati ya land yao like where they're supposed to be living so they're like nyinyi ndio mna trespass na ukiuta ukiuta nambia urudi itakukimbiza unajua hajalipo shughuli unaweza kimbia they do But now how do why do you think elephants kill a lot of people <laughs> more than even lions? Azijo. They kill a lot. Sijaona elephant. Why lie? Nataka Okay, now na nataka kwenda na wajuni ya hii holiday. Fanya hivi. Ukimaliza hapa just go to YouTube and check out a few documentaries. Nimeona, nimeona kwa TV. Sasa hiyo unaona ndio sababu mimi nataka live live. Ndio mimi hii ya TV nimeona. Hata YouTube got it kwani. But anyway, unajua kuna zingine za India zinapakwanga mpaka Qtex. Have you seen those ones? Sasa hii one yao mashe. madumba man. Karibu uchome, karibu. No, there's something I've never understood with the uh, we Africans. Mtu akiamua ku pet an animal, mnaanza kusema ni dumba. What's wrong with you? Si ni dumba, obvious. No, si dumba. You just try and mnitanga um, adopt an animal from its wild to domestic. I know. Do, dumba. Simba, 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 animals, jizi. Animals Simba, so, nani? Demon, uh, jizi akachukua nyoka. Aka, 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 how, kufu, inatoku, kufuga. Kufuga. Yeah. Akafuga nyoka kidogo mnaanza kusema, oh, hey. hiyo sasa yeye yeah, amesha yeah, ingia yeah, huko kwingine. I'm like, <laughs> this is a pet. Wazungu you know, you know, wakiwa nayo mnasema hivi. Yeah. But Africa, that is like, why, like why you draw the line. Do you know when a domestic animal inaenda wild? Do you know vitu vit, inafanywa ngo huko? That's actually true. Yes, it survive. Yeah. Ili umbo kuwa domestic. Sasa hii ngombe ikipatikana huko kwa forest, hao ngombe wa huko hata tulia <laughs> hii ngombe. Kala like, ikiona Mungu tu aliweka place yako. So kila animal ni kile place ile kwa kama wewe ni wa wild. Stay yeah, huko. wild huko huko ndo unafuna. Wewe kana sisi hao. Anyway, because of time let's move on. Do another story talk to us. What do you think? What do you think about these stories we're talking about? Um kumuki Tarzan aliweka kwa forest na kasurvive hadi he became a man, you know. Mm. He adopted to the condition. Mm. Anyway, and there's Mowgli as well. Mowgli, exactly. <laughs> But anyway, Kenya's whistling queen Priscilla Waimani has defended <laughs> uh, has defended a lady who slept outside her boyfriend's house after he refused to open the door for her due to another lady 
being inside the house allegedly. Now, the man identified as Kevo reportedly decided to move out of the house after the video went viral and Priscilla Waimani called him out for his behavior. She criticized his lack of empathy and encouraged people to treat each other with respect and kindness. The incident has sparked a conversation online about the importance of healthy relationships and communication between partners. And of course, uh, this is courtesy of Obidan Della a big shout out to him for all those stories. We have videos. Let's have a look. Like it's okay, go banana. Like it's okay, go banana. Like it's okay, go banana. Like it's okay, Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> The first thing, <laughs> if his name is Kevo, run. Mm, if he is and Kevo and he is Luo, Murife, don't even look back. <laughs> There's another breed that is coming up. Honest. Come on, Kevo, Kimbia. Come on, Kevo, and then Woko Kakina Ronald. Murife. Don't look back. So, he's scared to Kevo. Brayo, Sistivo, Buddha, like, you know. Excuse me, Honor, do I mean, but this is a Magina. Kevo, excuse me, and I eat of okay. Brayo, Brayo, and I eat of Obra. In a depend, but in this case, I can use the same Obra. In a depend, Kelvin, in a depend, Kevo in a Kwanga, Namta. So, Kitwa Kelvin, when you are, when you Kelvin, but you act, you know, when you Barbie, I love Sakuna Kevo when you middle class. Iki kujia voke. Voke za niatari. Na yobra. Geto, geto. Ha, yobra sasa we ni brayo. Akiwa Brian, he's a cooker. If he's brayo, ana, you know, akwa osawa, kiasi. When it comes to yobra. Kia yobra na yobra. It's a problem. Na vosti. Vosti. Kia vosti. Jonte. Jonte. Right? But let's talk about it though. Like, can you imagine, like, when you dem women are going to tell you, and therefore, you're going to be first of all, you're going to be able to do it. Heels. When you're going to be six inch, you're going to be able to do it with six inch heels. You're like, what? I love this woman later shopping. I'll go and buy din and carry a bag. Give me a gunia. Instead of going with language, I'm going to jump back on the shopping and me. But maybe you say in sick, we can't do anything. No one has created one of them. Ah, ah, like I said, you're the viral like I'm going to hammer. Ah, 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 I'm a niskit when I think I'm going to love to see no one to chat chat to. I'm going to come. Hmm. What is that? How come I'm not getting one? But I'm going to get one. Muda choma. Vokia kufungua. Vokia kuai fungua mlango day one hadi saa hii. Nyumba kwanza nyumba kwanza ni ya mawe. Tutaunga ufungue. Wacha zile za ghetto. Unapita. Fungua mabati. 
Kwanza nechapanga tu na hapa. Kama ni zile za hota wale mavoke wa hota wana. Fungua ama tumwagie nyumba maji. Zile za matope. Nyumba ni magiwa maji na hapa. Zile za matope. Sasa ni amawe. Unajua inabidi ya. Mbwana. Kikimaliza mtazidi tu. Nyumba ya ushangwa ya kumwagia maji. Ayezi ya chana. Ina wa chana. It has a very like a good foundation. You are lying to us. No, zina wa chana. Mwaka tu maji mzuri kulize. Sisi ni science. Uwa umetanganya na samadi. But anyway, but anyway, uh, have you ever been in a, in, in a situation like that? Like, because when I was old, I make a drama. Pia, Alinda carry bugari. she's like, what would you do? Where where would you mean in nani? You see, and she had to be held by the security, like where your area. They're just like. Another Leave it alone, Achana Nayo, like, you know, <laughs> come down. She's like, no, I'm not coming. The Maliza is still on our way. So, but why? I'm going to end up with Gary. Are you the drama queen ever? Me. Hey. Hmm? Hmm? Story about that. What am I going to do? I don't think you're going to do it. I don't think you're going to do it. Do you remember one incident? Tell us. Do you remember one incident? Tell us. Do you remember one incident? 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 You cannot coexist no more. It's always war. While what? What are they here? Ukraine, Russia. Ile sasa ni war. Cold war, man. Which war? Asa cold war. Ile ni world war three. Cold war ni lemu nengia munaishi pamoja baada ya kuelekea ni. Ah, world war three. Kila mtu nengia ngatu pale na zile mapunching. Owe, muili yako ni punching bage nje. Juu na juu na zingi hivi kofi pa. Mwingine na zingi gumi ra. No, but advice to the ladies, manzi. If you're going to your boyfriend's house. Make an appointment. You have. Sema unakuja. Sema unakuja. Two more texts. Nakuja. Baby nakuja. Manzi, I'm coming, baby. Na nakuja na shopping, blah, blah, blah. So that kama kuna co-wife, ni wanze kumprepare mapema atoke. Munaona watu muna date. Muna siya mdo walaongea. Visa ni kipo yu. Wae wacha kuniruka. Wase niruke. Hakuna bailing ine. Indo bailing. Indo bailing. Oh na sikia hivi vitu na happen everywhere ju. Ah nisikie wakadinali wanaangoa wasema Dema alikuja kunitembelea bila appointment. Hiyo ni extra pressure. Mm -hmm. Sasa unajua hiyo ni pressure ya nini? Sio unajua tu alikuwa na mess. But anyway, why mbona ukwe na demu yako na umplay? Right? Like Maybe we didn't really ambio. We didn't do anything wrong. Me want to hear all the stories. Have you ever been in a situation like that? Usha ichitiwa ukalal. Usha wai lala kwa baridi. Kwanza lakini but I think yenu wanairobi so for her she's okay. Imagine to me travel kutoka ocha. Una kuzaa kuona husband. You're coming to see your person. You get to Nairobi. Mtu hafungui mlango. Na ume travel. Na ujui mtu ya yote Nairobi. Hakuna drama mbaya kama ya vienyeji. Kai. Hiyo wezi take. Ama sikia. Ufike na mekuzimia simu. Na ujui ya naishi wapi na ukota awo. Kienyeji ya napitaka na mlango. Kienyeji ya tafunza yu mlango. Na wako na nguvu. 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 Ule nenao, anenaka mtu mgutupu. Kazi za sulubu. Ule za sulubu huko ocha wako do strong. Ule kibu nyamawe ni wea atakufaa. Anenaka kwa mtu mgutupu. Nuna jua kama hawa yetu. Akikanyaga yu mlango. Kama hawa yetu wakina filin, filin atalia. Jumara nails sa hezi taka kuchoma. I don't see. I think I'm literally the one person who doesn't care about my nails. I barely ever do my nails. No, Filin. Like I do everything else but nails. Nila otu aja do nails. No, Filin are you a drama queen? No, for real. My nails are very weak. Niki stengeneza once, like I'll have to go three months before I make them. I have really weak nails. So apokwa nails. Are you a drama queen? I cannot relate. Are you a drama queen? Oki pata, oki ni. No, 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 no. Oh, so oki ni pata na nani kwa nyumba, you just walk away. Drama? Why? Like, what are we fight? What are we fighting for? Fight. See, you move. Kwa ni wani mawe. Like, atuna nayo. Toka. Up next, siwa mesema soko. Like, say soko ni chafu. So, ya bidu kwa ni ya kwa. Ya bidu kwa ni ya kwa ni ya kwa. Ya bidu kwa ni ya kwa. Ah, si, si. Ah, bro. Nah, 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 nah. We move. Tunasonga kama injiri. Like, it never happened. Like, kevo who? Atasa unajua kevo ni nani? Like, 
I don't, Vogue. I've never, which Kevo? Who are we talking about? Like, Vogue. anywho, anywho, anywho. <laughs> yeah, go out to, you have to be strong. strong Safa and Dani, but in the Taliban. No, you just share. But anyway, let's move on to another story. A legendary Kenyan musician, Nonini, emerged victorious in a legal battle against Cynics Company and influencer brand Mutinda. Now, the court ruled in favor of Nonini, awarding him a whooping one million shillings for the unauthorized use of his song in a video without giving him due credit. Now, the news of his win quickly spread on social media, causing him to trend on Twitter. Now, many netizens took to the platform to joke about crediting Nonini for fear of face, uh, facing rather similar lawsuits. The win is a major victory for Nonini and sent a message to, other, uh, to others to respect the intellectual property of artists, according to Mgenge True. And the memes are the ones that are sending me. Mona memes. The memes are so lit. Like you, you type that and then you're like, Wake not up. my words. No, I'm saying you go. It's like, no, Nini said it first. You know, I'm just saying, but you know, people, people we're like, what's <laughs> like, <laughs> what's <laughs> <laughs> so that is Brian Wittinda, the one who is sued by Nonini, of course. And um, Nonini spoke about it. And I, I think Kilamutu, if you're in Kenya, you probably know who Nonini is. There he is. But he relocated. I don't think he stays in Kenya now. He's in the US. Um, in the, yeah, yeah, he moved to the States. But, Alishin, you have a video, you post videos online, and then you use anyone's song. Mm. Right, let's do that. Story of copyright. Um, the other day, Nimona Femi One, she wrote something on Instagram, and I feel the frustration that artists have. Femi One, alikuana sema, kamo ni msani or you are creative in this industry, and you are trying to make it. Funga virago, toka, enda, run. If you ever get an opportunity to go to another country, go. Don't look back because this country does not. Ayeshimu musicians, ayeshimu, which is true. But now where I come in is. Juliani, kutabadilishwa na nani kama CCC. Uh -huh. Man, tumekot kifaiti kitu for the longest. Where I got involved with this thing is poxy pressure, marem. Marem poxy pressure, ndo alifanya nika kwa interest. Right, so uh, that is Nanini. Ronald, as an artist, how does this make you feel? Do you think there's a big win for Kenyan artists like Mali Mefika? Um, to, uh, you know, you, have, you start paying artists for you to use their work. Yes, I think, mm. uh, first of all, first things first. Noni is a legend, and Noni has been here for the past 20 years. There's Poxy Pressure, Noni, Juakali, all that crew. They've really fought hard for the copywriting, uh, my copyrights, for my, when it comes to Kenyan music. So I think he deserves, and being an artist, I don't mean he could a short fired. <laughs> my friend, Tunen and Dani. All right, Anya's. Oh, no, no, he's, he's being petty. Um, it is good what he did. Because mm. I don't think it's, it aired on TV. I think it was just like for like IG or something. But mm. I'm not sure. Me, 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 I do for her. Though, mm. I respect no nini. Sana like, mm. niki grow out of the year, niki mentor, toki grow. Mm. But man, say, I'm going to buy. What to watch? What to watch? Bambi. Time yako iliisha. Na goma ako iliisha. Inafu kubali. Unajua yano kitu wazaniwa wataki kukubali. Time yako iliisha. Wase wako wane, hata ni wase wako wame kusahau. So in case mtu wala kitu miango mako, like ajaribu kuwanya shawatu kulikuwa na mtu wali kwa naitua. Mtu ya mezaliwa tu wa five ajuino nini. Unawana, ajuino nini ni nani. So wakisikia kitu kama ya, oh kulikuwa na msani ya naitua nini. Like, sa usidhania kila mtu wa mezaliwa kijua kulikuwa na msani ya naitua hivi. Wasani wakenya wame sota. Mbaka kiti hote neza leta do, wanataka kufuatilia. Uyona kama huu jamaa, dancer, na hitwa nani? Oh huu choreographer, na hitwa nani? Mgani? Hati choreographer. Huu choreographer huu. Moya, moya Davis. Moya. Mm -hmm. Ametumia ngoma ya wenyewe. Mwenyewe ya kona do hata ametulia. Mtizedi ya na ngori. Mm -hmm. Lakini ya dance yake mungi metumua tu kidogo. Zambu ya hile njako na hayo. Anataka yeah, kusuki jani ya wenyewe. Na ya jalipia hiyo ngoma. Like Kenya tukona njama mbaka ukisikia hapa kuneza toka do. Unataka ku, no nini uko US kwanza, jiwatu wanadhani uko fiti, so 
hiyo ni movie ya kuonyesha maybe una suffer place huko out yeah and you kuna vitu five kufuatilia fanya hivi history to the lap pale room after the show because right now we gotta go bro we are out of time but shout out to all of you that are tuned in right here let me just shout out a few people uh and call it i have a uh, biggie spies tuned in nasina mengi leo good to see you kanji wakasuku nasema hello tuned in from nyahururu kevin na brian wanaka chelsea how are talking number 10 hata wakimi Anyway, Jay Mundaji, leo filini hata wewe to show, eh? Unajua unakanga innocent sasa. Sana wewe uni Ah, sasa hizo ni gani? Ni gani? Can you say had had break is right of passage. Everyone has gone through that, but we move. This story what what we hata tukumbuki. Anywho, at Jay Mundaji, you get your elephants zinafanya um zinafanya hapa Kenya inafanywa na wase ume western by the mumias unasema hiyo kitu wale fans inafanya ni watu wanafanya sasa kipita kila mtu anapuli ni wazake anyway um uh, <clears throat> he saying uh naitanga mbogi truth linjin always love from me to you thank you ernest ameuliza ka elephant ni carnivorous ni kajua ronald ako right thank you sis for Hey. 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 <laughs> <laughs> It's alright. What's up? How are you, Janet? Na sema hizo elephants zinakulamiwa <laughs> ni za huku kwetu mumia. Salim yako ma Chelsea fans. Ah, eh? Ah, what any was about Chelsea by the way? Salim yako. Na madai ni mbona? Wewe ni wa kibodi, you tuned in from Naivasha good to see you. Jonathan uh, Wambo na sema keep up the good work. Thank you. Michael Wanyonyu na sema you are representing from Kinango and uh, in Nyandarua. Thank you so much. Ras Bashiri Were good to see you. You tuned in from uh, Busia Nicholas wa Storm unasema history inanikumsha back in Kiriani Boys High School wachana na secondary za siku hizi those time wanaume walikuwa wakubwa huko na ndevu kuliko baba atulikuwa unafua nguo inakauka ikiwa kwa mabega washandwea I'm telling you Kevin but why you know endelea kujenga taifa good people thank you Irungu Jen was nice to see you my people hiyo ilikuwa wiki ya ya kurudisha vitu yeah yeah everyone was just doing that let me say it comes me in we did thank you so much for keeping it here thank you so much for watching the show we appreciate that but we have to go do you have any shout outs as we go Alice yeah yeah as yes because a jamini mtu wa mbogi okay last week ilikuwa birthday sister yangu happy birthday sis na jo na what show happy birthday yeah. happy birthday happy belated birthday yeah happy birthday alafu wase wote wana what show nimesema asante sana akina jona akina biki spice kenya kama kawaida asante ni sana jo tukutane ni kesho right yeah ronald yeah charles karioki mzee na jo uko na mama hapo na kuna baridi Hope each time ikutoa baridi. Sawa. Uh, tuko na Masiketa, tuko na Caleb kama kawaida. You're always tuned in. Tuko na Brian Machange, tuko na Zadi. I have a fleet of people a star wherever you are. Manze always keep it locked. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Kidogo sha kwa Mluya. Salamu azishi. Juni mekana waluya. Shout out to Anna. Shout out to Ronald. Uh, what am I saying? Shout out to Alan. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Ano Ronald. Shout out to Ano. Thank you so much. Shout out to Alan. Morris. Shout out to Morris of course. Shout out to Rose, Yvonne. Shout out to who else? Shout out to uh, Ariel Asante Sana. Thank you so much Ariel. Literally everyone that made the show possible. We appreciate that. We we'll see you again next week. Kesho. Nile siku stay safe. <laughs> Just stay safe. That's all I'm going to tell you. I don't know how it's going to go, but I'm hoping uh, that everybody is going to stay safe wherever they are. Just make sure you take care of yourself, right? Yeah. Just yeah, stay safe wherever you are. Yeah. We we'll see you again next week. Peace. Bye.